Well, we're uh, rededicating the Ocean Exploration Center, which I think is a critical part to this whole exhibit because here we get to continue the voyage of exploration beneath the sea. It's a beautiful facility. There are very few like it in the world. We're so happy to be connected to the, uh, to the facility here in Belfast because our ship of exploration, the Nautilus, is getting ready to go to sea again and we'll be broadcasting live to, to the facility here so the people can uh, literally go through their spirit down to the bottom of the ocean and, and explore what we're exploring as it's happening. But you literally will sit in this facility and as you are watching the screens, you're, you leave your body and you travel around the world at the speed of light and down the fiber optic cable aboard the Nautilus and then all of a sudden you're in Hercules and it's like you're there. What's really nice about it is because we have production studios at the Interspace Center, at my Center for Ocean Exploration in Rhode Island, guests can actually ask questions of us while we're in action. We can literally be right in the room with us and asking us about what's going on. So it's a wonderful way to not only experience it, but to also ask questions, learn even more. The Ocean Exploration Center provides an opportunity for the next generation of explorers to learn about the importance of the ocean and also, in many cases, the conservation and protection of the ocean. Now, the Titanic exhibit is, is really wonderful, but there's also the future, and this is all about the future. <laughs>